are from Melody Susie. So thank you to Melody Susie for sending me this nail mail. So we're going to go ahead and get into this box. All right, we've got some from the United States Postal Service. Let's go ahead and get into it. Okay, got my little scissors here. Up. All right. So we have Melody Susie Fleury Gel Nail Polish Gift Box since 2009. So it's really pretty packaging. Blue is my favorite color of all times. So, and this is a really beautiful shade of blue. And so you have some things. It's called Urban Chic. Um, so this is really, really pretty, really, really pretty packaging. I'm, I'm, I love it. So I'm going to go ahead and get this opened up and let's see here. All right. Let's get this open, y'all. Nice and sealed. In this box, we have a greeting card. And so details, it says details on the back. So we're going to flip that open. Thanks for choosing Melody Susie. This box contain, contains four gel nail polishes. Oh, it comes with a nail brush set. Oh, and a specially designed vase and dried flowers. Oh, wow. It says, scan the QR code for more surprise gifts. Oh, wow. That's pretty. And so here we have the four polishes. These are half fluid ounces. Okay. And it tells you here, shake gently, apply a thin layer of color gel on the nails and cure for one minute in an LED or two minutes in a UV lamp. And so we have four polishes here. P29. P14, we have P03, and P11, and then we have an empty bottle here, really cute, I love this pattern, and it says, pull me up, pull me up, insert flowers into the base, and go ahead and pull me up, so that's what we're going to do, we're going to pull you up, okay, unlock this layer, now this is some really intricate packaging to enjoy the gift of fluoride oh oh look oh these are pretty nail stickers oh these are pretty and oh these are cute too nail stickers i didn't expect that in there that didn't say that on there dried flowers so these are supposed to go into the vase Ooh. Let me see what these smell like. Let's see. Okay, they smell kind of. I can't get the smell. It smells like flowers, but I, I don't know. I don't know the smell. So you're supposed to stick these in here, the dried flowers. Stick them in a little vase, and now you have some decoration on your nail desk here. So there we go. And then we have this nice nail art brushes set. And so um, you soak, fill a small bowl with warm water, soak brush bristles in the water to remove the wax layer and wipe the excess off. Okay, okay. Switch the brush and cleaner solution, which I have cleaner solution as well. So here are the brushes for Melody Susie as well. This is a, not nilly, this is a really nice um, box. And so you can see with these brushes, um, looks like this could be an acrylic brush or some type with the pointy end. You have a liner brush, a shorter liner brush, a longer liner brush. This looks like a square gel brush with a small end of a dotting tool there. Um, another looks like gel brush and an angled. Maybe this is a cleanup brush possibly because it's angled. So this is actually pretty doggone awesome. So thank you, Melody Susie. We're going to swatch these and I'll be back. 
So before we get into these swatches, I do want to show you that I do use, um, or I do have Mel Susie um, base and top coat. Um, I purchased this um, off Amazon, and I purchased it back in like 2023. Purchased this in 2023, um, and I haven't used it yet. It's still in the box, and I purchased that too. Never mind my other beauty stuff, but I was just like, wow, you haven't used this yet. I have my um, Melody Susie um, cordless nail drill, and then I also have... Um, the dust collector so those um are the few products that I do use from melody Susie, and i also use their um their sanding bands so i use their sanding bands um so like i have the small sanding bands it came with the um mandrel and the uh sanding band so i did end up buying that i really like the smaller ones uh, so I have those things. So I don't know what you'd be like, oh, you're just using Melody Susie all of a sudden. No, I have the stuff. It's just, I'll be busy with work and now just life is life in right now. And, um, I just get to it when I can. So we're going to swatch these and let's get into the colors and talk about these gel polishes. So we have these four colors here, P3, 11, 14, and 29. So we're going to go ahead and swatch these if I can get them open. Um, that's why you always need your rubber band in your hand so that you can get stuff open. Because me and this gripping, we ain't friends. We ain't friends. Hand in hand. We ain't friends. We ain't friends. Hand in hand. All right, let me turn my lamp on here. And so these are vegan polishes and they are plant-based and HEMA free. Now they don't have like too much of a noxious odor to them. I do smell an odor, but not like, um, you know, which some gel polishes smell like, like burnt hair. They don't smell like that. They have a pleasant scent. And so this is the black. It's a little jelly-like. Um, again, this is one coat of color here. Okay, very jelly. Okay, I'm, I didn't know there was like a jelly-like color. Okay, that's that. We're going to pop that in the lamp for 60 seconds. We got P11 here. Can okay, move these away from the lamp. We're going to get this one swatched. This is a nice... Actually, this is a pretty nice shade of pink. This is like bubblegum pink. Uh-uh, what's the... Say shake. Let me shake this. I know they say you're not supposed to shake gel polishes, but we're going to shake gel polishes today. You know, because the model, the instructions say it's shake. So we shaking. Shaking, baby. We're shaking. Okay. So this is the pink. This actually has shimmer in it. Okay, shimmer come through. Now, I don't know what that gunk is in there, but gunk, you got to go. Gunk is a pump. Um. Mm -mm. Y'all, my chair squeaking. I'm trying to do a voiceover as I, I mean, talk as I go along, honey. So when that happens, you don't, I don't know what I'm going to say. That's why I don't, <laughs> that's why I don't talk and record. We done said some choice words. And we don't want to have no choice words on social media. Okay, now I don't know why that's gunky like that. But, uh, okay, now you, they playing with me. Okay, there we go. All right. Yeah, that one kind of smell like, hey, this one smells like roses. Hmm. Interesting. I'm trying to be done hit my face with some gel polish, but this one smells like roses. Okay. Now we're going to get into P14, which is a white. Let me shake it. Say it shake. We going to shake it. Shake it, shake it, shake it. Now shake it up, shake it up, shake it like that. Okay, here is a white. Okay, white, white is white. Ooh, that's a nice um pigmented white. Okay, not streaky like I thought it would be. Most whites, me and whites ain't friends when it comes to um 
that didn't come out right. Me and white gel polish are not friends. I love all races. So, um, this looks like, does this have shimmer in it too? I can't tell. My eyes are deceiving me. Okay, let's see. Okay. Okay. The white is giving. Okay. We're going to pop that in the lamp too. And the last color is P29. We're going to shake that one up too. White didn't smell like anything. Okay, let me make sure. Oh, wait a minute. No, this smells like, this smells like, it smells like, I can't catch it. I can't catch it. That's, that, okay, that has a scent too. I, I, I'm not catching it. The P11, which is the pink. Oh, this one smells like roses too. Oh, this one's P29 smells like roses. Wow. Okay, Melody Susie. Oh, that's a pretty, that's a pretty, pretty shade. I see these to me, these Valentine's Day colors. That's what this is. Okie dokie. Okie dokie, auto chalky. Now that was that was the smoothest one of them all. Okay, that's pretty pretty. Okay, pretty pretty. So y'all, here are the swatches living their best life with one coat. Now I do think with the black and the pink, these are two. These do I think need two coats of color because you can see how once I pick it up, it's very sheer. But um, these are smoother um, and has more pigmentation. But I'm gonna go ahead and go ahead and uh, do a second coat of color oh oh yeah yeah okay that second coat that second coat now nah. that's doing it yes that second coat is doing it okay all right now okay the second coat of black is giving. So we're gonna pop that in the lamp. We're gonna go ahead and do that second coat of pink. Make this go a little bit faster. It's still gunky. I don't know why that pink is gunky like that. It's just weird to me. Maybe because it's been sitting in here in the air in my basement. That's a lot chunky. It's still pretty though. I don't know what's in this one. Now that formulation. Oh no, what is we doing, Lord? And so somebody be like, it's an uncured gel. Nope, it was like that when I pulled it out the um bottle. Okay, that's the second coat of that pink. Okay. We're gonna do that white, which I will say, I don't think that white needs a second coat, but you know, we're gonna do a second coat. Anyway, make sure you apply your polishes in a thin layer, even if you were doing this on yourself or even on your swatch sticks, because I've um, swatched colors and on swatch sticks later to go back and find they just wrinkled. So, you know, if you do that on a swatch stick, you have high probability of doing that on your own nails. And what I've heard is that that can lead to gel allergies. So that's that second coat of white and the last color is the red. The red is my favorite. They're all pretty, really basic, pretty um colors. Okay, 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 okay. Now the red wanna play with me. Um which I think red, I've said this before, I think red is a year-round color. Um, but I really love a red and during Christmas time. It's like the best time. Um, but this one is more like a fall red, but it's still pretty. Look at that. That's shiny and nice and shiny. Pretty. So, y'all, here are the four swatches here. I did apply this um, Melody Susie top coat here and cured and so again nice and shiny thank you to melody melody susie for sending me um the fleur we kit 
to feature on my channel. And again, these polishes are 21 free, HEMA free. I think the other version of HEMA free, HPMA free, if I'm not mistaken. Um, so, you know, they really took care um, with these, these launching this product. And so here, um, I just pulled it up on Amazon. And so, yeah, HEMA HPMA TPO 21 non-toxic. And they do have, I'm um, showing you how to use it. The series, 33 plant-based colors. Um, so there you have it. There you have it. So again, thank you to Melody Susie for sending me these products. And then with the colors, um, like this one color, I don't know how much it said it retailed for. I think $9.99. Yeah, $9.99 for one polish. But again, this was a kit. So I appreciate you guys for watching. Again, thank you to Melody Susie. I hope you have guys have a good one, and I'll see you next time.